Good afternoon, good evening, good morning, wherever you may be in the world. I would like to thank you for stopping by Healing Inner Child Wound Conversations with Z. I'm Zuri Bibi, or Rita as my friends know me. Um, I'm just gonna, I'm here to do a, just a short reading. And we'll see if it really is going to be short. Um, I pulled some cards earlier and it gave me an energy of this envious person. And um, there is some envy you're, you're transforming and they don't like it. I didn't pull any tarot on the reading. I just did um, Oracle. But we'll... I'm going to pull on camera some Oracle um, and see what the storyline comes, comes up with now. Because it's always different. It's always different when the camera comes on. On the bottom now it says door to personal healing and happiness. So a lot of you are doing that and your ancestors, this is the eagle, you're flying above. This witness card wants to pop out, but we're not doing that. Um, birds are part of my spirit team. Um, I learned, my dad taught me that before he passed away. He always told me that he wanted to come back as a bird. Birds were his favorite animals. And I never got a chance to ask him why. But I notice everywhere that I move, it's always a lot of birds there. So, you know, I know some of them are my relatives. But I know some of them are perks. Ops. Oh, that's funny. Somebody's driving off as I say that. Okay, well, I know you're out there. But anyway, let's ask for protection. I would like to thank the divine for being in the space. I would like the divine to burn off any negative energies that may come in and try to change or twist the reading in any way, shape, and form or return it to sender with the red hot flame. Then I would like the angels to come and cover me wing to wing from the top of my head to the soles of my feet. And then after that, I'm asking for the white light of protection to cover me from the top of my head to the soles of my feet, left, right, front, back, and extend it 20 feet. And because I know that this body that I am in, in this lifetime, is the vehicle for my soul, I'm asking for another layer of white light protection, top of my head, soles of my feet, left, right, front, back, and extend it 200 feet. The angels are with me, the divine is with me, the archangels are with me, the ascended masters are with me, the aliens are with me, um, my spirit guys, spirit team are with me. Who am I missing? Uh, shadow, higher self, inner child, ancestors. Everyone is that is here. Of the white light that is of high vibrational energy even if I haven't named them they are welcome into this space and I'm asking that whoever comes to this room into this space in any day this is timeless that they are afforded the same level of protection that I'm asking for it's said it's so it's done all right so let's see what this is about I'm only pulling five cards Can I have a message? Oh, wow. I'll take it. No, I'm not taking that. We'll look at it, but I ain't taking it. Treasures of the Hidden Shadow. Broken Heart. Oh, somebody's coming out of a broken heart. Time master. You are able to master time, or somebody is. 
ghost dance. This is your ancestors. Like I said, the ancient ones, your ancestors. Beauty way. Beauty. Yin and yang is balance. The serpent. Transformation. And covenant. It's a silk contract. There's something going on. Something's going on, but this is what actually fell out. Caterpillar. You have an opportunity. There's some type of opportunity coming to, to you. Cornucopia. It's going to bring a lot of abundance and beauty. Oh, man holding a coin. Okay, it's a divine masculine out on the board. And there's a community. These people, I don't know. I'm going to put one more card. When I see community and it's three people and it has a seven on it, it might be something deceptive, but I don't know. Transmuting pain. Fool's embrace. There's a new start. Transpersonal. Um, people are watching. They wanted you blinded in pain. I'm going to hold on to that. So let's look at this. There's some type of opportunity... And the community's watching. Like I say, they see you coming into abundance and they're watching. And there's a gentleman here, or masculine energy, that sees you um, transmuting some pain. After being blinded by pain. Not only being blinded by pain, but you might have been pimped out. Poisoned. Some type of black magic might have been done. Because that's the only dark card out here. Everything else is bright. Even the caterpillar has the divine gold energy on it. But this one is transmuting something. Something very painful was done to you. Um... We're going to see what, um, oh shoot, oh no, that's right. Relief and repair, you're repairing something. You're repairing your heart. Let's keep it real. You're, most of the time you're trying, you're repairing your heart. And I have a card and we'll read it. We always get this one, safe to be seen. So maybe a lot of you have been hiding. Acceptance. Wow. Okay, let me stop. Because whatever is going on in this community, you're being the opportunity you is saying you're safe to be seen. And as far as this corn eucopia and the ancestors watching you. They want you to accept something. So there's some kind of lesson that was being learned. And you're going through a rebirth. These cards came out before. This one wants to come out. No, I'm not keeping it. We just read that. Can I have a different card? Look. It came out. I I'm going to keep it. You're having a daring rebirth. And this came out before, too. You're going into your power. Somebody is moving into their power. This is crazy. Y'all, I, I shuffled the cards, and it fell right out in my hand. So something that was painful 
It's being repaired. Being transmuted. We're going to use these little kitty cat cards that my little star seed gave me for Christmas. I, I kind of like the cards. They're pretty cool. Yeah, somebody was in this energy. You were mentally imprisoned. Hmm. All right, can I have a message? Wow, everything I just said was the truth. So there's going to be some type of truth coming out. And it may have something to do with a sexual relationship. Some action was taken. Seven of Cups. There was some illusion. There was something that was meant to confuse you. Something happened. In a family situation. Can I have a message? Okay, so we have the tower and we have the three of wands. I'm gonna, the tower's on top. There's a tower moment. Somebody's having a tower moment. Something ended. And after something ended, now somebody's looking forward or planning something else. And it has something to do with money. Now, the bottom of the other, when I showed you before, it was Ten of Pentacles. So, a family situation may have ended. Because there are two people on this card. A relationship may have ended. Can I have one more? Look at that. Has something to do with money. Someone may have been giving to someone else. Will of Fortune is on the bottom. So somebody's fate may have been tampered with. Let's keep going. Can I have a card for the Ace? What is this Ace? Of sword. The truth is that something has been put to rest. Ended. But looking at this card, it could also be that somebody has been laid to rest. They have, they're on to their next journey. Wow. It's a relationship. And they are watching. Wow. They were the three-party situation. And that's why this illusion was here. Seven of Cups. A lot of confusion. Illusions. Can I have a card? They were trying to confuse a relationship. Somebody's happy family life. But somebody's healing from that. I see a card sticking out. I'm going to pull it. There's two cards. Yeah, the, um, it kept them stuck. But now that the light has been shown, there's healing taking place. And that healing, they're moving to calmer waters. And what is this tower about? The tower is causing somebody to go within. Somebody's being told to go within and 
search why they felt the need to do what they did with this three-party situation. Where do they where do they need to heal? Three part this is the night, this is sex energy. Um, why are you so flighty jumping from person to person to person? Um, you're never um, truly committed. You need to heal that. Something happened in your childhood for that. And normally that is a learned behavior because you, a parent cheated or, you know, you, you were tampered with. And that's the cleanest way I can say it. As a child, you don't focus. You're in and out. This is what you want, though. You want to be stable. But because of the in and out situation, you can't be stable. But this is what you want. I'm going to pull one more card. This is you. I'm talking to a feminine that may have been tampered with. And she might have been always been the third party. But at the same time, this person cheating could have done this to the Empress. Either way, there is some inner child healing that needs to take place because why would an emperor stay with somebody that's in and out what's on the bottom here yes yeah, a lot of sadness oh somebody sad because a relationship has ended it's ended but because it's ended you can it can there can be a transformation Can I have a message, please? I'll take them. They all flipped, but I'll take them. Um, it ended, and somebody has walked up, walked away. And they're walking towards their clarity. So this was, this was a masculine. He's protecting himself. From some magic that was done to him. So this masculine was the one. That could have been the one tampered with. But he's healing. What's coming forward. In the future. Oh. They want a soulmate. They want, they want to get back with the empress. Can I have a card for the Two of Cups? Can I have a card? Which one you want me to take? There's too many popping up. Okay. Thank you. Somebody in the near future, somebody wants to invest. They're looking, they want to there's an investment they're making and they're looking at it because it's something supposed to come come back from it yeah it's something they're working on i'll pull something else anything anything else yeah they were juggling that's this masculine he wants to invest and because he wants to invest, he's in this page of pentacle energy now. And because he's in the page of pentacle, pentacle energy, he's looking at his stability. Whether he's holding tight to something or knowing that he is okay. That was a confirmation. Confirmation if you heard that horn. A masculine may be holding on to his pentacle. Can I have a card, please? 
whatever this pentacle is, he wants to offer it to the queen of pentacles. And queen of pentacles is a wife, so he may be trying to come forward to offer this. She's hope, but she's holding her own pentacle. But he's trying to offer her a pentacle. Oh, he's coming as the king. Okay. Because I was getting ready to say. He's coming as the king. He wants to offer. And he wants to have a reunion. Oh. He wants to have a reunion. He He's balanced. Because this is what he wants. He wants ten of pentacles. With the empress. He got a broken heart though. Justice is some kind of justice is um, being given out. All right, that's that. Yeah, this per this person's coming into their power. They have a vision. That kind of look like swords. And a butterfly. But they, there's something. And this could be happening in different parts of the world. Yeah. Uh, okay. I'd have to pull the other cards off for that. Now, what does the divine have to say about this? What does the divine have to say about this? King of Pentacles. So there is a masculine energy here. King of Pentacles has mastered something. Something's coming down into the earth. What other king was here? Um. I don't remember now. Um, that's the last, the king, the king of pentacles. The pentacle is the last thing before you manifest something. And the magician is here. So this, somebody was, was doing something to this masculine. And that's what caused the ending. But this masculine is going to be able to use this magician. If he does the healing right. What does Source have to say about this? Can't make it up. There's going to be some justice. And there's going to be some type of reconciliation. And there is a Queen of Source on the bottom. So this could be the Divine Feminine. Yep, there was some moon magic done. Can't make it up. On a relationship. Can't make it up on a relationship to a cup's energy. What kind of justice is being done? King of Cups. Somebody was affecting somebody's emotions. Yeah, this is an emperor. Yeah, there's King of Pentacles, there's King of Swords. Now we have King of well, King of Swords again. No, King of Cups. This is the Emperor. Justice. And it's coming swiftly. This is the Knight of Swords. It's coming quickly. Somebody's in high priestess energy. This king, this king of cups, that's moon energy, and the king of cups is very intuitive. He has healed. Like I said, this this there's been healing going on. The sun came out in the other part of the reading. Look at that. Somebody was stuck. This came out too. They're now. This individual can look at the whole situation from a different standpoint, a different perspective. 
this is the truth. There's a card sticking out. Now he wants to come in as the king of wands. Look at that. That's all four kings. The emperor should be coming out soon. He, he wants to rush in for a reunion. Anything else? Anything else with this um, Three of Cups? He He's walking toward, he wants to come um, toward this reunion for this Empress. Anything else? He has made a decision. He's made the decision. He's made a decision to go toward this Queen of Cups. King of Cups is already here. So we already have the King and Queen of Pentacles. And now we have the King and Queen of Cups. So there's been a mastery of some sort. And the um, Queen of Swords did pop out. She was on the bottom. This is going under the moon. Whatever was going on was bringing some type of lack. And that was the that was the hidden hidden um, things. They wanted to attack a star. I don't know if they're saying the the masculine was the star or the empress was the star. But I am the cards are over by the empress. Look at that. They're moving past ten of wands. Whatever this burden was, they've, they've moved past it. It's been revealed, so it has no, no longer has power. And you all are stable. It says, Lord of earthly power. Look at that. Look at that. There is power right there. And that power means with those four pentacles, you're stable. You're not in lack. Anything else? Somebody is salty. They are salty that, that the moon has revealed what they were up to. They were doing some kind of work with, with this moon cycle. Lord of material work. They were working with somebody to do something. Anything else? There it is. They're ready to invest. Somebody was investing. They were heavily invested in doing the moon magic towards you. And they were they were constantly rushing in. Anything else? Now they want to apologize. They want to apologize and they want to come and um collaborate with you. Hmm. Nope, stay over there. All right, I'm gonna stop here. Um Somebody needs to do the inner child work on the early part of this message. There's something came up, and I I do suspect that it was some type of um, sexual trauma, um, whether it was just being touched or more. It could be more because that... That card came out to be seen, I think. Where is it at? I don't know, even know where it is now. But it was a card saying, is the oh, is this me? This one. Somebody might have been um made to do things that they didn't want to do because that looks like a picture.
somebody had some black magic done to them. They might have been. And then they could have been drugged also because to blind them. You got to be blind. To be, you, I don't see somebody in their right mind willingly taking them kind of pictures. Unless you were a child and you ain't know no better. But even then, there's something about that. All right. I'm going to thank you for stopping by Healing Inner Child Womb Conversations with Z. I'll be back. Peace.